Hello again, and welcome back to the video where we turn my garage into Beetlejuice Beetlejuice. Hanging this fabric is killing me. It's ruining my life. <laughs> it's a hot mess. I'm very nervous. I have three days and I've not done enough. Feel that rhythm, feel it deep as he dives into the unknown. Okay, I think I finished with the tree. I added two big things of cardboard and pinned them up to the ceiling just to give it extra height and drama. See, it looks much better. And then we've got the little headstones and you see the little vines. I think it turned out pretty good. Barney did open the garage door though and knocked it over so I had to put it back together. So it's been run over but I don't think it's noticeable. We just have to hang fabric. I've already done most of the garage. I've got to figure out what's going on with my projector. It's not working right. And then we just have to clean up in here and set up tables for dinner because we're having a dinner. And I've already got the sound system hooked up, so it should be fun. Okay, it's just a few more nights until the party. So I'm just getting things put in place here in the kitchen um, for the food that's coming. I'm so tired. Okay, let's see what I've got so far. So I bought these off Amazon. The package came with two of these boxes, which are very cute, packed very nicely. But uh, this is, what is this, 52? So it comes with, you know, the big plate, the small, the napkins, cups, forks, spoons. I just got them in black. My other option was purple, and I thought if I have extras of these, I can use these for any for any old thing. These are some cups that were left over from my last party. So I'm just gonna put them in these. This is, I don't know what I'm doing here, but we're serving Polynesian food like I told you earlier. So I've got my little pineapple Polynesian Pineapple skull. There's a little picture of Beetlejuice. Musical sounds of a fountain. And then I do have it lit up green. So it's hard to see. But so this will be the buffet. We're gonna do more on this side. I'll show you after it's ready. But yeah, I have just a lot to do in the house because I've been spending so much time in the garage, I f forgot about the actual main house. Misty! Hi, Misty! Okay, so friend of the channel, Faye, came and brought her portion uh, that she worked on of the cemetery, which really helped me out because I had too much to stress over. But look, she sculpted this. And she put reflective tape so that when the light hits it, it looks like it's glowing. Um, we still need to add a few things because it was a cardboard cutout, but you can see she made it look three-dimensional. Because to like get one of these sculpted this size, even if I made it my own from scratch, we'd be looking at maybe 150 bucks. Um, and then this this was like 40. So it's a, it's a huge difference. Um, once we add some moss and stuff, you won't see the lines, but it looks really good. Okay, so I'm going to hang this cheap plastic brick here to mimic, you know, the portal into the netherworld when you draw it in chalk and knock on it. So it just came to me in a dream. And I guess while we're here, let's kind of show you where we are for now. 
So I've added lighting. Um, I still need to light this sign with the spotlight. I just had to get a cell milled to me so that I can uh, diffuse the light. It's too bright. So that when people take photos or selfies, it blows out the, the picture. So we need to lower the, the light. And I'm not buying another light. I'm on a budget, okay? So then we did a projection of the moon. I can't remember if I showed you already. I added some scrim. I'll just show you. Oh, I gotta unplug my sprinkler system, it's blowing. So I hung some of this, like, I call it scrim, but what is it called at the store? Like, uh, taffeta? I don't know. So the moon's projecting on the back wall, on the black fabric. It didn't look good directly, just on the wall, so that's why I added this scrim in front of the, the curtains and put it up, put it forward like a foot. Because, I don't know if you can tell, it kind of gives it a more magical, ethereal look. It also makes the clouds look like they're three-dimensional. It makes the moon look three-dimensional. And then you're not getting the hard lines from the fabric as, as bad. So, and then of course, here's the beautiful headstone that Faye made for us. She just amazes me. Okay. I've got to now set up all the tables, chairs here for the audience, because this is a karaoke stage at the end of the day. Let's see if we can back up a little. I mean, it looks pretty good for having no idea what I was going to do, I think. Okay, this is how I wanted to have it look at the end. So I just added some creepy cloth just to give it some more texture, make it look a little less fake. And I like it. I took acrylic paint and I did like a bright yellow so it pops better with the green lighting to do the draw a door in case of an emergency. And then, voila, it opens. This costs four bucks. So, four bucks, Amazon, have a time. I have to take a break. It's my birthday today, actually, so I'm gonna do nothing. I'm not, I'm not touching that garage. I'm gonna go sit in the hot tub. It's rainy, it's misty, it's finally fall, and it decided to bring it on my birthday. I'm so, I'm so excited, I love fall weather. Let's just see if you can see anything. Look at the sunset, isn't that beautiful? It snowed today. I decided to put something out in the yard. Just something little so people know to come in. Cute. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. It's me, Beetlejuice. Your house and the party has begun. Let's take a look. Say hi to Faye. Hi. Say hi to Jessica. Say hi to Wendy. We've got the decorations up. Let's flip around. I was rushing so much to get everything together, I didn't show you guys the finished product before people got here, but let's take a look. The girls. Okay, let's start from the beginning. Okay, so this is the front, y'all. We're just walking in. Come on in. I just wanted to show this little sign. Cute, right? the entrance. Never trust the living. Oh, I forgot to turn the lights on. But yeah, come on in. We just opened the dinner up, so get all the food you want. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what this moment is, but then we have in here, Wendy's doing tarot readings tonight. <laughs> How's the food, everyone? Good. What? What's different? That's what I served at my mom's thing. And I served that last year, so 
But more banners? No, we've never used more banners. Oh, maybe we did once. Yeah, I don't like them. This one I like. They're a friend of Barney's. It's called Sweets Bakery, Sweets Cafe in Provo. We've got Beetlejuice playing on the TV. And okay, let's go outside and see the grand finale. First, you have to draw a door if you want to get out. Oh, hi ladies. Okay, here's the finished product. It's very foggy right now, so you can't see everything. Hi, people from TikTok. Welcome. Welcome to the party. I mean, we're gonna have karaoke here in a minute. Do you guys wanna say hi to anyone on YouTube? No? It's okay, you don't have to. It's not live, it's just for my channel, for my video later. You don't have to. Come say hi. Hey! Hi! Look at these sexy ladies. <laughs> Wait, can you show us your costume? Oh yeah. Because look at this. Oh, All right. Oh, you guys, cat. you need just a little whip. I mean, I do need like a, a little whip. whip. I need a leather whip with a leather whip. Spikes yes. in it. <laughs> Absolutely, you look so cute. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Getting a lot of happy birthday messages right now. Twinning! <laughs> so. Okay, who wants cake? Absolutely. <laughs> it's winding down the party. Let's take a look at this weird balloon thing I made. I don't know what it is, but man, I didn't record much of this party, but it's over pretty much. But I just wanted to show everyone this beautiful set I spent hours of my life making. I think it's cute. I'll leave it up for Halloween for the trick-or-treaters. Cute! And I'm your host, Beetlejuice. Thank you for joining me on this journey to whatever this was. Happy Halloween, bitch! Feel that rhythm, feel it deep As he dives into the unknown Adam's groove will make you move You'll never feel alone Adam's cool and he's hip He'll take you on a trip The paranormal Polynesian Whether spooky or fun Or a tale he has fun The paranormal Polynesian the Neon lights or abandoned sites We'll find our way Our way all around the world what may, what may, and when the fun is through, here's what you can do, play one more episode, he has hundreds, hundreds, travel fun for everyone, travel fun for everyone, the paranormal
fun or a telly has fun. Yeah.